we want to write the two vectors in component form. The component form of a vector is this form here. When a vector is written in this form, the initial point is the origin, and the terminal point is the point x comma y, where x is the horizontal component of the vector, and y is the vertical component of the vector. So even though the initial points of these two vectors are not at the origin, we can still find the component form of the vector as long as we can find the horizontal and vertical components. And we can do this by forming right triangles. So if we consider this vector v, if we form a right triangle from the initial point to the terminal point, it would look like this. Where this would be the horizontal component, which we'll call x, and this would be the vertical component, which we'll call y. So moving from the initial point to the terminal point, we move left three units, so the horizontal component is three, then we move up five units, so the vertical component is positive five. So the component form of vector v would be three comma five. Now let's consider the red vector. This would be the horizontal component, and this would be the vertical component. So we'll call this x, we'll call this y. Moving from the initial point to the terminal point, we move left four units, so the horizontal component is negative four. Then we move down three units, so the vertical component is negative three. Which means in component form, we would have negative four comma negative three. And that's gonna do it for this example. I hope you found this helpful.